Oh yeah, don't you know my chocolate so you never want on. Oh we're going. You get hungry on the journey. Eh? <laughs> so much for joining us for another video here on Married Moments. If you're joining us for the first time, I am Nayoka and this is Steven. Alright, so today we actually, we're actually over by Tartolo. We're going to look at some apartments because yeah, we've decided to move. We've decided to move over here so we're just gonna check out some apartments and um, well the first apartment that we'll be checking on we're actually just waiting on the lady to just um, accompany us there so now we're just sitting and waiting but as we go along then we'll share the journey so see you then hi guys so we're back um, Actually, it's food time now, so you're not gonna get much of a Steven. <laughs> but um, we looked at a few places, about four in total. I think we have our men's been up already, but we have some. We have From some the first visit. From the first, very first one. But um, yeah, we have some appointment. We have like how much more viewing? But one, no one. or two. Oh, two, two. Two. We have two more viewings and it's raining heavily now. It's crazy. We actually um get to we have to keep in the car because now it's only take out here because um we have um, increase in the cases of COVID so they definitely can't dine. So we get some food we're in the car, we we'll buy the seaside. Just to show you how crazy it is out there. So you can hardly see anything because we really by the seaside. You probably can't even hear. Yeah, maybe can't even hear. But yeah, um, so far, one thing to note though, the apartments in VBA, they are mad expensive. They are really expensive. They are dear. They are really dear. But, as you say, we find both. The first one that we looked at is it's yeah definitely with our budget and it have pretty much everything that we were getting at our current apartment. So we 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 love it, we love it, and can't start with window with that one. But we have the um, whole of our end of the bargain in terms of our other appointments that we'll have we'll have uh, we have scheduled. So we'll look at that and then we'll be done for the day and uh, we'll have our minds made up about what we're going to do. So yeah, it was a uh, pretty interesting, pretty interesting day so far because it's been raining from last night and um, yeah, crazy weather today. But yeah, it's mega eat right now and stop the talking. Alright, so we can just catch you later. Alright, so we did the last two um, visits and yeah, Stephen Ted is a lot of driving. Um, but the first one, as we said before, is still leading, and I think that's the one that we're going to go in. Call you, man, no. No, no, no. Call you, man, Sabbath, no matter what I call you. Hello, don't miss a part, Sabbath. Anyways, yeah, so right now the plan is for Stephen Carlin. <laughs> I will go return the rental here and catch the boat. Go back home. Yeah, so go out here, I eat the other half of our lunch and yeah, as we said bring back the rental and thing. So yeah. That's it for today's um runnings another town <laughs> and 
So, this is our last day in this apartment. Gonna miss it a lot. Bye bye, apartment. Oh. Is that 
actually five, five minutes. Yeah, this is Beef Island Airport. settling in in our um, new apartment um, well, this morning Steve is not here with me he went over to our whole apartment to just find
time too and I'd make sure that everything was good and to leave the place in basically the condition that we got it. But um, here, 38 weeks prego. stretching or you know work the ball somewhat but um we love our new apartment it's very nice comfy very homey and it's in the hills so it's very cool last night actually we didn't have to use any ac well i didn't have to use any ac because Stephen, now Stephen balling for cold normally it would be me but him seem cold now because um, what the doctor explaining is that now that I'm pregnant because the blood flow is um, like twice the amount it like heats up the body more so most nights I get in the sweats and all of those excitement so yeah I have to normally run the AC but last night I didn't because we left the windows open and the fan was running and it was so cool like really cool and um the vibe of here it's like country life you hear the crickets at night and all of that so who grew up in the country and know them them way they hear crickets at night and all of those insects out and then like during the day you hear the birds chirping and all of that so kind of relax um out of the city out of the town so that's good it's about 15 minutes drive from the main city restaurant town um yeah that's pretty much it but you know what i wanted to um like speak on is like the cost of rent here in the big so like it's it's pretty expensive expensive housing like really expensive over here um, and we find out that they well found out that the pricing for housing was different in Virgin Ghana versus what it is here on Tartona. I don't know why it like really like more expensive over here versus Virgin Garden. So you're looking at um for persons who just want to know to know or thinking of making a transition. Um you're looking at for a one bedroom unfurnished in Virgin Garden. You're looking at Maybe around starting from about maybe 650 to 700 and in Tartola um, unfurnished again you can get something for maybe thousand dollars that's unfurnished when you talk like 1500 you're talking a, a one bedroom furnish or a two bedroom unfurnished so those are the prices so for two bedroom furnished on Tartola you're looking for like two thousand to two five yeah the prices get really crazy in Virgin Garden the two bedrooms pretty much would be like fifteen hundred well it be, depends on furnished furnish it depends on um, what a landlord or lady might have in the property and what we found out also is that there's pretty much no regulation as to how the prices are 
like how they come up with the prices because you have some people have some crazy prices and then you have some people have some like yeah so yeah this can work and also sometimes the, the places that you see and the prices like the, what they want for the place you know, like, All the places that we looked at on when we came over this was the place that we said we saw first and we instantly made up our minds and said then this would be it even though I was saying I don't know if I said it on camera but I was saying that it was smaller than our um, previous apartment but actually it's, not, it's way bigger I don't know what was happening with my eyes maybe I wasn't wearing my glasses or all of that but I think um, it's a good find especially that it's not so far away from town um, it's yeah it's not, as I said it was 15 minutes 15 minutes drive and like from the airport we can get there like 30 minutes so um, everything is is conveniently in reach or okay to what we might like because when I when I go to the airport often for the drive 30 minutes and based on where Stephen and I would work it's um, convenient as well so that would be um, and yeah when I know where the baby go be like in terms of daycare or whatever what we have there so that is another thing to yeah, another hurdle to overcome when that when that bridge come we'll cross it but for right now it's just um, settling in and understanding all of what is around and how we get to what we need and yeah, pretty much overall settling in so um i don't think i showed you guys um outside so i think i'll just do a walk through and let you see how outside is it's it's really nice and last night when it's the lights over yonder it, it's just really nice and peaceful and clean air well that is one of the things here in the baby i have had a as for the beach now, we don't have the beach that close like we did in Virgin Garden. Virgin Garden is pretty small, so as you drive, you reach. But um, we still have some perks here that yeah make it satisfying. And in everything, like you just have to step out and changes happen, and it's just life. So yeah, like we're gonna see what going on outside. I know if it didn't make a lot of noise because I wash, so the machine didn't make a lot of noise. This is what's that? Oh, we get a dog, so we're gonna go play. Pretty friendly. Yeah. So, over yonder, you can see the sea, but I think, yeah, to get to the beach, shoes somewhere, so we we'll figure out that part. So that was one of the porch. We have another one for our bedroom. Oh yeah, we've been not as big as the last uh, one. Let me miss that, but we have a lot of other stuff. Oh, this door lock. Oh, so hard. So, this is how it is. Like a porch here, so.
about it for the new apartment and yeah adventure coming across the water on the barge that was a nice experience it was first for us um yeah so i hope you guys enjoyed this vlog and um just stay tuned and rock it with us and we'll see if we can keep on pushing out stuff and Make it interesting. I don't know how interesting it can be, but because it's just our life, so it's just what is happening is happening. Can't make up no more. But yeah, so see you guys next time on Morning Moments. Have a great day. Goodbye.